high frequency separation. This is a request from a subscriber. Load your image, right click the top layer and add an alpha channel. Duplicate your image, go to filters, blur, Gaussian blur and blur it by 20. Go to the mode button and click grain extract. Right click the layer and new from visible. Go to the mode button and grain merge. on your high frequency layer, return to the normal mode to right to the top, <coughs> select the healing tool, increase the size, control key and a left mouse button and clean up the images. You take on a sample of the skin and clean up all the blemishes, large blemishes on the skin. Duplicate the image, go to the mode button and grain extract. Go to layers, my layer mask and add a layer mask. Grayscale copy of layer. Choose your paintbrush tool and paint over the areas you wish to reveal underneath. It takes in the eyes, the teeth, the lips and any hairline you wish to highlight. over the thumbnail, fingernails, any other hairline you wish to bring out. Now go to opacity and lower it by 76%. Right click the top layer and flatten image. Now that all the hard work's been done, there's another way of doing it. This way uses the filter package called GMIC. You click on GMIC. Now if you don't have this filter package, you can go to the website listed below and load it onto your system. You scroll down and click on the down little arrow point there and click on that one. You scroll down and click on smooth skin. Even the default settings will give you a very good high frequency separation. But I'll increase this to 79 by using the tumbler there. And also the smoothness up to 2.9. And then click OK. And it does all the hard work for you. Just click on that one there. And you can see the difference it does. Now it finds the skin tone and works on all that instead of touching the hairline or anything else. All this procedure is in a PDF file on the website listed below.